The 2022 annual Southeastern Kentucky Chamber Awards Night is September 27th. For tickets, call 606-432-5504. You can also watch live on the free Mountaintop TV app. On Friday, the Pikeville Polars will be hosting an arm feud competition at the Appalachian Arts Center. The competition will go until Saturday the 24th and will require a $100 entry fee. Both spectators and participants can expect strong competition, awards, and a large cash payout up to $2,000 for first place. Well, the event itself is the first one we've done of this kind. We've been doing this for about four years, and generally we do it during uh, Hillbilly Days. This year we elected not to. Uh, it's the second largest money show being put on in the United States this year. Uh, we're paying out over $6,500. That's guaranteed purse. I mean, it doesn't matter if the competitors show up to cover it or not. That's a guaranteed purse. I'm hoping and truly expecting well over 100 competitors and hoping for somewhere around 130, 140. And this is this actually is the fifth tournament that we've actually done here in Pikeville. But this is the first mo big money tournament we've done. Most of them have just been uh, trophy tournaments. This is a money and trophy tournament. Atkins is excited to put on a show for Pikeville while raising money for Shriners. He expects to see a surge of support from the community following the event. Well, I'd like to get as much support from our area as we can. We are going to, uh, instead of charging an admission at the door, we are going to have the Shriners there taking donations, and all that money will go to the uh, Shriners uh, charity, where, whatever they want to do with it. We're just we're going to give that to them. I uh, would like support from the community. We've had a hard time getting the community to back this, and I'm not really sure why, because it's huge everywhere else. So, you know, we'd appreciate them coming out and, you know, watching. You're going to see a real good event and, you know, come out and help support the Shriners too. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.